check out what I woke up to this morning. Do you see all the little spider webs on the ground? Those are so cool. It's kind of foggy, misty out, so it's catching a little bit of the water, so you can really see them. That's so cool. I know, totally, Kathy's like, I'm not camping out there with all those spiders. <laughs> there is a bit of fog on that lake. How cool is that? Good morning, friends. I woke up here early this morning. I'm at Purtis Creek State Park still. It is Sunday morning, I think the 27th of January. What a great night. It was so peaceful and lovely. And a lot of stars out last night. That was very enjoyable. So after a quite leisurely morning of just hanging out at the campsite, watched a little bit of blind views this morning, I'm gonna go do a little more exploring at Purtis Creek. I saw a trailhead down here that looked interesting, so I'm gonna go do a little hike and go check out the picnic area before I head back home. Thought I'd take you along. Thanks for coming. This is our little day use area. It's very cute. It's got an old timey uh, place out there made out of metal, it looks like. How cool. That's very neat. I love it. Well, no wonder this place is so popular in the summer. I get it. They have kayak rentals even. Lots of picnic tables, lots of parking. It's like a boat ramp too. Neat. I haven't seen any motor boats out, just kayaks. I guess there are some though because there's some boat trailers here. Very neat. Beautiful little plot park. Hmm, rent now. Paddle boards and kayaks. Can't tell you the last time I saw a set of monkey bars or a metal slide. I love it. Cool old swing set. It looks like a little swim area, a little beach. I often wonder who the heck comes up with the names for some of these trails. This is called the Beaver Slide Nature Path. I'm going to go check it out. <laughs> Sounds cute. They also have primitive camping out there, so I guess that's like the backpacking sites. And it's showing on that board that a bunch of them are reserved. But there's no cars up here, so I don't know if anybody's actually down there. We'll go check it out. I don't think a beaver chopped down that tree. No, no, I, I don't think that's what happened there. Cute little pond. I don't see any beaver sliding though. Some tall cedar trees. This is cool. So this is where the little campsites are, the hike-ins. Very neat. A through M, that way. Huh, I don't know what's up that way. I see something, but I don't know. What is that? Hmm. A little privy. Go check it out. Okay, what I thought I was seeing through the woods is blue paint on those trees. Yeah, very cool. Very cute. Interesting placement. Interesting placement indeed. Huh. Alrighty then, carrying on. A little scared to look in here. Let's see. Oh, not bad. 
All right, this is campsite A. It's got a little fire pit and everything, so you're actually allowed to have campfires back here. I am quite surprised by that. For some reason, most Texas state parks don't let you uh, have fires in the backcountry because it's just too hard for them to keep an eye on you. And I get that, so. So I don't know how far this first campsite was, maybe a half mile in, so if you ever want to do a quick, easy backpacking trip, this might be a destination for you. Pretty easy terrain and a beautiful view. A little bit muddy today though. Yep, let's go down and check out the water. Sure does make a girl want to fly a drone. Not allowed to in the state park though, dang it. So pretty. Alright. Very cool. It is really shaping up to be a beautiful day today. I had to lose my hoodie. See how it's supposed to be in the 60s today here in North Texas. So I am enjoying it while I can. But next week it'll be winter again. Anyway, I just wanted to thank you guys so much for coming along. Uh, thanks for helping me explore this beautiful state park. Purtis Creek, well done guys. Very well done. Thoroughly enjoyed it and I will be back. Anyway, I hope you guys will be back too. Y'all stay lost my friends. I often wonder who the heck comes up with the names for some of these trails. This one is called the Beaver Slide Nature Path. I guess there's beavers sliding around out there? <laughs> I don't know. Take three.